I'm visiting with Coach Michelle Ladd at Coach South Plains College Lady Texans. And Coach just got back from a long trip in Arizona. It's been uh, been an interesting start for you, I think, 2011-12. Let's start out and talk about the season as a whole here so far. Not as many wins as you'd like, but it's a pretty young basketball team for you for this year. You know, absolutely. We <clears throat> obviously coming in, uh, you know, you're trying to win games. Our schedule has been tough. I mean, we've played several ranked teams, and, you know, we've been in, in some games. I think it – we are playing a lot of freshmen, and I think they, it's just taking them a little longer maybe than, than I anticipated to just to kind of get used to the college game and, and that type of thing. You know, it's we can get three or four of them going, and then, and then someone may not have a great day, you know, someone else. So we're just trying to talk to them about getting consistency and, and coming every day. You know, it's, it's harder work than they've probably had to do in high school, and so it, it's been a big adjustment for them, and, and we're hoping that they'll – They'll continue to work at it once we get going here in conference. Yeah, you can talk a lot about basketball and the adjustment between high school and college. And Grant, you know, you know, the game's still played basically the same way. The ball's still the same size. But past that, you know, the way workout schedules work and practices and classes, speed of the game, exactly. physicality of the game, there's just a lot of things that change between that high school level and that college level. Exactly. You know, and they, they did well in the classroom first semester, but, you know, just keeping them on that schedule, having study hall. I mean, we, we, you know, we take up a lot of their time. I mean, this is their job. And so we take up a lot of their time. And, and so they, they're continuing to adjust to it. But, you know, as a whole, we're continuing to get better. And I think that's where, where you want to be is that their understanding that came back from Christmas, uh, some of them worked out and did a good job with that, you know. And so, so I was pleased with how we came back. And then now it's just continuing to get ourselves back into shape getting ready to go. Watching this team a couple times I've got to see it. It is a team that there is a lot of basketball ability on. I don't think there's any question in the quality of players you have out there. And frankly, it looks like a considerably deeper roster this year than where you were at this time last year. Absolutely. You know, and it, and it is. I mean, we do have some talented kids and it's just getting them in the right spots and and again, that consistent thing, just every day, you know, showing up practice ready to work hard, showing up in the games ready to go. But yeah, I am, I'm pleased with our deep. We're probably going about nine or 10 right now. And, and the, I'm, that's a good thing, you know, that we're not, we don't have anybody having to play 40 minutes and then they can play harder while they're out there. So, so I'm pleased with where we're at as far as that's concerned. You get this trip to Arizona, and it's got to be nice to take a basketball team and just kind of get them away from everything. You get away from classes, from friends, from and nothing against all those things, but it, it kind of really creates a new environment for you in, in which to coach it. Exactly, you know, and it, it, it was it was nice out there, and, and we had some fun. We had a day off, and so we, we took them to an outdoor mall, and so, so we had some fun. But it is good, to, and it's good to get us back as a group uh, you know, kind of that team chemistry type thing and stuff, and and so that I think that stuff is huge down the line as far as trying to win games when when you get in a tight game, you know, staying together, and, and so so that a trip like that definitely brings that out, and and then it you know playing our way back into shape. Uh, we had we had several practices while we were out there, and then and then played four games, and so and that's the idea. That's what we use it for is to get ourselves ready for conference. Looking at the season as a whole at this point, is there one thing you put your finger on? And you say, boy, this is something I'm super impressed with the way we've come along and we've done front half of the season. You know, I think I think Ashley Roberts has really come on uh, and and is is playing well for us, and, and and the rest of these freshmen. I mean, they're they're continuing to get better. You know, we've had, you know, another one of our problems is we've had several injuries, and we've had. These games out in Arizona was the first time that we've had all 13 of our kids together, you know, and, and a couple even sat out out there. So I think just just continuing to, to heal up and to, and to stay together. But, but, yeah, I'm pleased with her, her leadership, and, and getting these freshmen going. You know, she's been through it. Uh, and, and so if they will respond to, to her leadership, then I, I think it will help them in conference. Get ready to open conference play coming up on Monday night, and there's no easy ones in this yeah. schedule, but you open up with an animal. you got Midland right out of the gate on the road. Talk a little bit about this basketball team. Uh, you know, Midland's really good this year, just like always. They're, they're pretty deep. Uh, they're they're going to be a lot bigger than us, so we've, got, we've really got our hands full there because he's going to have four, six, three, and up post players. And so, you know, we – we have to, and so we're going to have to. We're really going to have to get some good help side. We're going to have to get our guards to helping out on those post players, and and he's kind of his wing players are, are some freshmen, and so I don't know as much about them. I've watched them a couple times, and we'll continue to to watch them. And you know they're they're going to play that same style they always play, the high low stuff. They're going to press us for 40 minutes, and, and we've got to we can we've just got to rise up and continue to get better and and work on the things that we're trying to get better at this week. And, you know, see what happens. Grant, you maybe were a little bigger right out of the gate last year underneath, but 
this year you've got a little more height brought in, but I was always impressed with your help side defense last year. You played some big teams like Midland last year and played them pretty well, I thought, in the paint most of the year. And that's and that's what we're, you know, obviously that's the way we'll try to play again is, is getting our guards to dive in there and, and help out on those post players. And, and if we'll, you know, if we'll work hard at it, I think we can get some things done. You know, it's just it's just then getting them boxed out. You know, sometimes we have have some issues of putting a body on them and not letting them get that second and third shot. So I think we can defend them for that first shot, but then it's getting the rebound and, and seeing going down and seeing what we can't get done offensively. But you know, hey, we're gonna work at it. We'll they'll be ready to go. We'll see. All right, coach. Just saves that time for this one. Final thoughts for us before we let you go. No, I'm you know we're excited to be back home. We're excited to get conference started. You know, and and our record is not where we would like for it to be, but. It's a whole new season. Anything, anybody that's seen this conference knows that anything can happen. And, and if we can get our get everybody on the same page on any given night, I think we can win. All right, good. Appreciate your time as always. Thanks for dropping by and visiting with us. Best of luck to yourself and Lady Texas. Thank you.